a common query that I see a lot of people ask, and I get asked this quite a lot myself, is how do we change the font size on mobile on a Squarespace website? And we can't do this natively because once you set a font size, let's say it's two rem, that is set across both desktop and mobile and, and tablet and, you know, whatever screen size, it's set across the board. But luckily, what we can do is add some CSS, which will allow us to target any font on our website. And then what we can do is specify exactly what we want our font size to be across screen sizes. Okay, so the first thing that we want to do is go into design and custom CSS. Then we want to make sure that we're targeting only mobile. So this is the code we need to target mobile only. We're essentially saying the maximum width of screen is 640 pixels. If you want this to apply also to tablet, you could put it up to something like 1, 140, but we'll just keep it to 640 now because that's, that's generally the top end of mobile screen width. So we add this code and then in there, we want to add our target. So let's say we're going to make this smaller on mobile. Go into our mobile view. This is a H4. So I'm going to put H4, squiggly brackets, and then I'm going to put font size, and then let's make that 10px. And you can see it's smaller. But then when we go into desktop, it's the same size. And we could do 15px. Whatever we want it to be. We also don't have to use pixels. We can do rem or m, or maybe it's rem and em. I don't know. I'm going to call it rem and m. But anyway, that, that's how you do it. And if you want to change other fonts, so this is a H1 up here. All you have to do is H1, do your brackets, and then we want to put font size again. And then let's do 2 rem. You can see that shrinks down. You don't have to use rem. You can use m or px. So we go to desktop, and you can see that's exactly the same. If we were to get rid of our media query, you can see it then applies to desktop because we're saying H4, H1 to be this size everywhere. But for mobile, this is what our code should look like. And you can also do this for different breakpoints. So let's say you wanted a different font size on, on your tablet. You go into tablet view. We copy this and then we'd say maximum width and then we'd bump that up to 1140. Change the font size. On our h1 maybe to three so it's larger there but then what we have to do because that will then override mobile is just make sure on mobile we add important and that will keep the mobile code intact so we've got mobile where it's smaller we bump it up to tablet it's larger and then we bump it up to desktop and it seems like it's applied there so what we'll have to do is just maybe bring that down there we go so 940 seems about right so we'll go to that once more mobile nice and small gets a little bit larger on tablet and then back to our normal size on desktop and that is how you change the font size on mobile and i had it in tablet as well if you did find this useful please make sure to leave a like hit subscribe and check out all of the squarespace resources in the description below